Hello everyone, this is Doc Aaron, and welcome back to another Minecraft Redstone video. In this one, we're taking out my first, well actually not my first, but one of my first Redstone contraptions involving honey blocks. Anyway, so it's just a simple piston door with a couple double piston extenders on the back with slime blocks and honey blocks. So normally, if you only had slime blocks or, or only just honey blocks in this area, you need a triple piston extender and those are incredibly complicated. Like, my attempt for a triple piston extender is right here. It's incredibly complicated and doesn't work. Like, Okay, so that moved this twice. We got the double piston extension. I'm not even sure if we got that. Okay, so this starts right here. Now where does it end up? Okay, that see a redstone in bedrock is slightly more unpredictable than in Java, so on occasions it'll work, on occasions it won't. And then if you click this again. See, as a, as a, I, this is just proving that redstone, when it comes to double pistons and triple piston extenders, is just way too complicated. Double piston extenders are way less complicated, and like in in Java, you only need a repeater here and a repeater here, but we need an extra repeater and we set this to a higher tick. It's still very, fairly simple. Now, I'm not going to be doing a tutorial, I rarely do tutorial videos, but, um, yeah, because it's pretty simple. Just, uh, a double piston extender with, uh, slime blocks like this and honey blocks like this, and another double piston extender, and you're pretty much good to go. Now, I did another honey block piston door, and this one involves... Uh, a triple piston extender, so it's definitely the more complicated out of the two. So now, as you can see, that moved the blocks up three times, so now the door is closed, and this triple piston extender, it took me forever to work out how to do this, and it's only two block tileable. So, click this again. It's not as snappy in the closing, but it's still pretty cool. Versus. Now, I'm not even gonna try to explain how this works. This is way too complicated. And I follow. At first, I was just started following a tutorial video, but that tutorial video was flawed, so I made a spin off of it. And I really, really changed the design. So I think I, I could safely call this my design. It's technically a spin off. I'm pretty sure I only made a couple of piston doors with honey blocks. I've been trying to find the other thing I made, but I just can't seem to find it. Oh well. Yeah, anyway, I've also been trying to work on a uh, self-building door. Like, um, self-building door, what the heck am I saying? Um, and I'm trying to build a uh, self-building house like my Bojumbo's video. But I've been having problems, and even with the Crimson Mechanics video on how it works, it's still pretty complicated. And I'll link to his video in the description, subscribe to him, he is a very good Redstone YouTuber, and possibly even better, well, very much probably better than me. He can do self-building houses and I can, so that's the same quite sick as Anyway, I really do hope that you enjoy this Redstone video. If you like the video, you like it, please be sure to subscribe. This has been Doc Aaron. I'm out. See you all later. Oh, and in case you guys are wondering, the number in the top right hand corner of the screen is my FPS. I got Optifine for my, um, for my computer. I quite like it, but anyway, the maximum always seems to be anywhere, uh, always seems to be 60 because I only have 8 gigabytes of RAM, but anyway, anyway, see ya.